customer is not always right. The phrase customer is always right was originally coined in 1909 by Gary Gordon Selfridge, the founder of Selfridge department store in London. And it is typically used by business to convince customers that they'll get good service at this company and convince employees to give customers good service. Contrary to the popular belief, treating the customers like they are always right can actually be harmful to your business. It can dampen employee morale, use of vital resources, and even hurt your best customers. In his book, Customer Centricity, Peter Fader encourages business owners to focus on the customers who matter most. Not all customers deserve your attention, he says. Not all customers deserve your company's best efforts. And despite what the old adage says, the customer is most definitely not always right. In the world of customer centricity, there are good customers and there is everybody else. Not all customers are created equal. Most businesses think the more customers, the better. But some customers are bad for your business. Believe it or not, there are some customers you don't want. If a customer is constantly complaining, abusing your employees, or creating stress in your company, they are not worth your time. They are not worth your effort. It doesn't matter how much money they pay. Unhappy, irate, grumpy customers not only cause bad experiences for employees, they also make other customers miserable. Using the slogan, the customer is always right, your abusive customers can demand just about anything. They are right by definition, aren't they? This makes the employee's job that is much more harder than trying to rein them in. Moreover, believing the customer is always right is a subconscious way of favoring the customer over your employees, which can lead to resentment among your employees. When managers put the employees first, the employees will then put the customers first. Put your employees first and they will be happy at work. When they are happy at work, they will treat their customers well. If you tell your employees to treat the customer like they are always right, you will make the employees' lives miserable. When it comes down to supporting your employees or supporting an insufferable, irate customer, you want to support your employees. You want customers to know that while you value them, you won't let them abuse your employees. There will be always times when your customers think that they are the expert, but if you adopt, the customer is always right policy, you can end up actually hurting your business. You kill employee morale, empower rude customers, slow down innovation, and even create unhappy experience for your other customers. So customers are not always right. The old adage that always talk about customer is always right can actually send in a wrong message to your employees.